Hey everybody, I am here wanting to share a Wellness Wednesday tip with you. So yesterday I posted a question asking what you crave more, sweet or salty foods. And I was intrigued by this because I've always had a big issue with my sweet cravings to the point where I could eat an entire container of cookies. Pathetic, I know. It was really bad. But that's why one of the many reasons why I love Shakeology so much. And so I started to look more into this and why our bodies crave food or why we manifest the idea that we have that hunger even after we eat. So what I found out is that even after having a full meal, our bodies don't absorb all of the nutrition that it should. So therefore, we still think that we are hungry because our body is physically telling us that it's not getting the proper nutrition. Um, so one of the major components in Shakeology is probiotics, prebiotics, and digestive enzymes. And what those do is help absorb the nutrients of what we eat into the bloodstream and into our body better. And so one of the specific ingredients that is a digestive enzyme is yukon root. <laughs> um, I had to play with that forever because I didn't know how to pronounce it. But anyways, it originates in South Africa and it's what's considered nature's apple and so it's naturally sweet, giving you um, that sweet fix and sweetening the shake a little. Um, it provides the prebiotics and the digestive enzymes to help our bodies absorb that nutrition more effectively. So that's my Wellness Wednesday tip, and that's one of the many reasons that I absolutely love Shakeology, among others. Um, digestive enzymes and prebiotics also help with regularity, if that's something that you struggle with, too. Um, so yeah, if cravings are something that you struggle with, uh, because I know I don't anymore, I mean, I'm human, I have cravings, it happens every once in a while, but not anywhere near it used to. And so if that's something that you struggle with regularly, maybe Shakeology is something that you should try. Have a great Wednesday, guys.